Section 1.4 is what's called on sale. A sale discount is a percentage taken off the price of an item. So last chapter we looked at markup, how they charge more for an item to cover the costs of their store. Now we're going to look at a sale discount. And think of reasons why they might give a sale discount. Well, maybe they have too much of that item and they need to get rid of it. Or maybe the item is old and they want to get rid of it. Or maybe they just want to have a promotion and they want people to come to their store so they have a sale. In any way, they, most stores do have sales. So for example, Nicole wants to buy a coat originally priced at $249.95. It is on sale at 25% off. How much is the sale price? So what has to happen first is you need to convert the 25% to a decimal, always. And then you have to think about, okay, well, let's see here, $249.95. And what do I do with the 0.25? Oh, yeah, I always multiply it. Now, when I multiply it, use your calculator. You got $249.95 times 0.25. So $62.49. $62.49. This is the discount. Now the discount means that's how much money she is getting off because she is getting the sale. So what happens is you take your $249, whoops, $249 and 95 cents and you subtract off the $62.49. So you end up getting whoops, you end up getting 249.95 minus 62 and 49, you get 187.46. 187.46. So this is how much money she is going to pay for her sale. Next it says, how much will she pay if 5% GST and 5% PST are charged? So this is obviously not in BC. This is in a different province. So if 5% GST, let's first of all figure out what the GST is going to be. So we have 187 and 46, oops, 46 cents. And remember, I have to change this to a decimal, which is 0 0.05. And I'm going to multiply it by my price, 0 0.05. <clears throat> so I get 187 times 0 0.05, $9.37. Notice that the PST is exactly the same amount. So my PST is going to be the same. It's going to be $9.37, because I'm going to be doing the exact same calculation, 187.46 times 0 0.05. I can add both those values together. So I have $9.37 plus $9.37, which is $18.74. And that's my tax, total tax. I have GST, PST, my total tax. So how much will she pay? Well, she's going to pay the $187.46 plus my $18.74. So what's the total going to be? $18.74 plus $187.46. $206.20. Now notice it's 0.2, but that doesn't mean two cents because there's a zero after that I have to add because it's money. So it's $206.20 is what she's going to pay. So make sure you understand how to find the cost of GST, PST, how to figure out what a sale means, finding the percentage of something, and because it's a sale or a discount, you subtract it, then add on your taxes, and then finally, your assignment is on page 56 and 58 of your workbook. Sorry, I should have put that in there. This is always, most of these are going to be out of your workbook. And then that's numbers 1 through 7.